my channel my name is Gladwell Kozak if you're new here for the first time uh, please do feel welcome and for all the returning viewers thank you very much for stopping by on today's video I am going to show you how I will be organizing my refrigerator I had done that uh, a year before but I did buy some new uh, containers for uh, organizing which are a little bit more sturdier and I think more reliable unlike the ones that I bought last year I did buy them in the same supermarket but these ones I can guarantee you they are far much better to use uh, they have compartments that is one thing and also they are different sizes which is going to work well for me so I will just show you how I am going to do and uh, yeah you might think that is also something that you can think of and also change how you arrange your refrigeration uh, so without further ado let's dive in uh, so guys my fridge is a Bosch uh, it's a fridge freezer uh, the fridge is on the top and the freezer is at the bottom uh, I've had this fridge for the last 11 years it's the only fridge that I have ever bought since uh, we moved into the UK and that's why for me I would actually highly recommend if you're looking for uh, a fridge something that will serve you for a long time to come it's never given us any problems so this is something that I would highly recommend and uh, yeah the, re the, the reason why I actually bought my uh, dishwasher a Bosch dishwasher is because we already had uh, the Bosch fridge which uh, has served as well so uh, on the other side is the Bosch uh, dishwasher that we bought uh, not too long ago about six months ago and it has been doing us a good job so I will be showing you uh, how I will be organizing my refrigerator last year i did bought i did buy some uh, organizing um, organizers and this year i have decided to change i actually did buy these ones from little is my local supermarket i had bought the same um ones that i use at the moment currently in my fridge from the same local supermarket but uh, these ones they are more sturdier and you can see they look like they will be uh, more long lasting and the other thing is the shelving is a little bit different so they have compartments and you can also be able to actually just pick up something without having to pull something out of the fridge so I just bought different kinds um, I do have something like this also uh, in my pantry which I use to put my eggs away so that's why I decided uh, to use the same for uh, my um, refrigerator uh, on the fridge uh, this is what I am using at the moment uh, as I said I bought this ones last year and uh, as you can see they're already cracking that's why I decided to uh, change them because the plastic was not very uh, durable so yeah I will be uh, showing you the end results after I have already um, removed cleaned up and then uh, organized it again with the new uh, shelves um, so I will go ahead empty the fridge clean it up a little bit and then I will put back all the products with the new shelf
so all the boxes are nice and clean and i have removed uh, most of the food stuff from the fridge so you can see uh, this is what i will be arranging nicely back into the fridge uh, these are some of the containers that i removed that i was using before and these are the original uh, fridge containers which uh, came with the fridge and this will be also the other foodstuffs that i will be putting away in in the fridge as well so uh the fridge is now nice and clean we can see everything is nice and done and i will be trying out the shelving first so that i have a rough idea of where i will be needing to put in the shelves um so with this they actually got this part of the fridge so i'll still be going in there uh and the rest i will just be trying out to see where best to uh, fit them in i think this one will do well being put in there and this ones i will be slotting this little one as well in there so that way i have tall ones in there that one uh there and the two remaining uh, or three remaining containers i will put on here because what i do want to have is this space i want it to remain uh, unoccupied together with this because some of the things that i usually tend to put in like containers and all that kind of stuff i need them to have uh, a bigger or open shelving so uh, that's why i have decided that's how i will arrange so i'll have two uh, tall ones there the middle one and then i'll have two uh, medium ones uh, smaller ones and then with compartments because these other ones they do have compartments and then this last one and then on this i will just leave it as open shelving Uh, so guys i have already set up uh, my fridge i have used the new containers that i bought so i bought these two tall ones 
and everywhere at the bottom uh, I usually go at the bottom is where I put my veggies and my fruits and here in the middle shelf which didn't have any shelving uh, pull up uh, for storage it was just an open shelving and I intend to keep it that way because that's where we can put those extra things that tend to be not regular leftover foods and all that kind of stuff so these containers they need to have a place and that's why I did not uh, change that configuration on here I did change uh, all these um, containers and these two they have compartments so that way I can actually be able to put in exactly what I actually want so on here you can see I have put uh, the guacamole and there there is the different kinds of cheese and there is also the herrings for breakfast uh, same as here I have also uh, put uh, different stacks so the guacamole and also uh, the butter and other spread as well and on here uh, we have the butter and the other spread so in that way we can still be able to use uh, those place to put uh, the things that we regularly use and on these two shelves in the middle and on top where the space of the shelving is a little bit higher there I will leave it for all those things that tend not to be regular it's just different things uh, throughout the week so I will leave that one at that and I think um, I have actually uh, managed to organize it better than it was before and I am loving the new look uh, of my fridge and uh, I do hope uh, you can also get ideas on how you can arrange your fridge freezer I haven't organized uh, my fridge uh, my freezer yet but uh, that is something that I am working on so yeah if guys you enjoy this video please do remember you can give us a thumbs up a like uh, leave a comment and also think uh, if you 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 are loving this material you can always think of subscribing and becoming part of this uh, family so that uh, you will be getting materials every time I upload any new videos yeah and uh, I do enjoy sharing any new things, any new developments that I, I do around the house. And uh, I do think that little things like this can actually uh, help to organize and make your life a little bit better. Uh, I will also show you in my pantry. Uh, you can also have ideas. These ones, as, as I said, on the... Uh, the shop uh, tag it said you can also use such in the pantry i did buy something like this but uh i didn't look I, I i bought i bought it in a different shop but it's the same kind of concept material i will show you i have used these ones in my pantry so i will show you how they look like so this is my pantry and uh yeah it is well organized and as I said uh, this is the same kind of containers which uh, they are not exclu exclusive to be used in the kitchen or in the refrigeration you can also use them for uh, storing other food stuff in the pantry so guys uh, I do enjoy being uh, a help and being able to help uh, give you suggestion on how you can actually organize your uh, house and your homes so guys uh, I won't take long on this one so I say you thank you very much for watching and I do hope to see you in the next one uh, bye for now